In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to create a Google form in multiple languages. Whether you're collecting information from a diverse group or just looking to make your forms accessible, this guide will help you step by step. First things first, you'll need to sign into Google Forms. Simply head over to the Google Forms website. There you'll be prompted to sign in. Just type in your email address, click next, then enter your password and voila, you're in. Now that you're signed in, it's time to pick the Google form you'd like to customize. If you haven't created one yet, don't worry. You can quickly start a new one from the dashboard. For this tutorial, however, we'll assume you've already got a form ready to go. Our next step is to create a question that asks respondents which language they prefer. This is crucial as it will determine in which language they'll continue to fill out the form. So simply type in a question along the lines of which language would you prefer to complete this form in or something similar. Once you've set your language preference question, it's time to type in the possible answers. These will be the languages you're offering the form in. For instance, you could have options like English, Spanish, French, and any other languages relevant to your audience. After you've got your language options laid out, look for the three dots located at the bottom of the question section. Clicking on these will open up more options for you to customize your form. One of these options will be go to section based on answer. This feature is incredibly useful because it allows you to direct respondents to different sections of the form based on the language they select. Go ahead and click on this option, then you'll see a drop down menu for each language option you've provided. Here you can choose which section of the form respondents will be taken to depending on their language choice. For example, if they choose Spanish, you can direct them to the section of your form that contains questions written in Spanish. Make sure you do this for each language option you've provided to ensure every respondent is directed to the correct language section of your form. Finally, you'll need to go to each section you've directed your respondents to and translate the questions into the corresponding languages. This step is pretty straightforward, but requires attention to detail to ensure the translations are accurate and the questions make sense in the context of the language. And there you have it. By following these steps, you can create a Google form that's accessible in multiple languages, making it inclusive and user-friendly for a diverse audience. Remember, the key here is organization and ensuring that each path is thoroughly tested to provide a seamless experience for your respondents.